Today on Minecraft Hydro Hunt, we make a secret Minecraft base inside a desert temple. This was a heart pumping episode. We had people outside our base, even just right beneath us. This episode is the most true hide or hunt experience when the odds are stacked against you. Everyone was hunting for me. Guys, you smashed 12,000 likes in under 24 hours in the last video of Hide or Hunt. If we can smash 15,000 in 24 hours, I will get another Hide or Hunt out this week. Also, make sure to subscribe if you enjoy the content. It's free and you can always unsubscribe later, but enjoy the video. Okay, let the games begin. Let's get rocking and rolling. What kind of secret base are we going to make today? I've probably said it in the intro because when I record the intro, I know what bases I'm making. But today, at the moment, in this current time, I have no freaking clue. Is there, was there a guy next to me? Who was who was here next to me? I've lost him. Where'd he go? He just disappeared. There was some dude. Okay, right. Let's go about the map. What have we got? Okay, we have a desert temple. I will take you. Is it actually? Oh, no, it's not in. Oh, it is in. Okay, I thought it wasn't in the world border. I was like, no. Is there anyone here? There was someone behind me. I don't know where he's gone. Okay, let's take it. Maybe he drank his invisibility pot. Maybe he is. Let's break this. Oh, God. Okay, let's take actually TNT. <gasps> Whoa. Oh, my God. An enchanted golden apple horse armor. Like, is that really needed? I don't think so. In it. Oh, my God. An enchanted golden apple. I didn't even know that was possible possible to get from these. Emeralds, I suppose, if any trading. Uh, we'll take the bones and we'll take the TNT for a trap if we want to do that later. Could be kind of handy. I don't know. Oh my god, an enchanted golden apple. Are they are they more OP in 1.16 compared to 1.8 or less? I don't know. Alright, let's do our usual thing. Let's get mining for a second, then we'll think about our base. Okay, we're getting plenty of iron. We have 16 so far. Okay, we're currently up to 33 iron ore. We have enough for a set of armor and a shield. Let's get a bit more in case we want an anvil. Okay, there we go. 45 iron. We're looking stacked and especially with that beautiful golden apple. Mm, that's gonna be delicious. I hope it saves my life. <laughs> All right, let's get out of here. Mr. Skeleton, drop me a bow. Mr. Skeleton, drop me a bow. Come on. Wait. Yes! <laughs> Perfect! Oh no, it's broken, but hey, it'll do. It'll shoot one shot. Thank you, Mr. Skeleton. You must have loved my lovely, sweet lullaby for you. Okay, right. Let's get up to the surface. Let's find out what kind of base we're gonna be making today. Okay, what base are we making? Okay, there's Slu. I just wanna see if I can kind of get a grip of where he's going. Where are you thinking of making your base, bud? Okay, he's ran off. Okay, so he's ran off in that direction. He doesn't have his base down yet. Team, does anyone have their base down currently? No. No one has their ba beacon down yet. Alright, guys, I've just decided what I'm doing. I am going to make a base in that desert tower over there. What I'm doing right now is I'm currently waiting for the 15 minutes of invisibility. I've got the idea. I've actually griefed around the tower to make it look like it, you know, someone's ran over it. You know, making it look griefed, I feel like people don't want to search it. If the thing looks pristine, they want to search it. But I'm going to attempt to make a base inside the desert temple. Risky, but it's saucy. And risky bases are the funnest bases to do. They get the heart pumping. We just need to wait for our invisibility, and then we're running back there. Alright, we're invisible. Let's begin. Okay, this is scary, because someone actually seems to be here. Um, and I think might know where I'm living. So, whoever they are, I feel like also has to be living close, so I'm gonna have to try and take them out too. But I need to get smelting first before that can happen. Chest acquired, even though a chest is so risky, but this is the base guys. I think someone knows about it though, but if I can find that person, take them out, the information dies with them, and our base lives for longer. Very risky though. Ooh, this is tense. I feel like someone knows where I am. I've never been in a situation in a while where like someone knows where I am straight away, and we both seem to know where we are. Okay, full set of armor acquired. We have eight minutes left on the invisibility. Okay, we don't have enough wood to make a shield, but that's fine. We can still kill someone, right? <laughs> we have a golden apple and everything. Yeah, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. There's someone here. There's someone right outside. They know it's here. This is probably game over for me. Oh my my god already no this can't be <sighs> okay we're gonna stop smelting so we make as little sound as possible we need to get out of this base quickly okay we have to dive out of here okay we have to find who knows about me okay we got six minutes left of invisibility that is my base inside there but the thing is when i was making the base someone walked right past the tower inside the tower i could see that i just don't know if he saw me she saw me i don't know and it's kind of freaking me out I feel like they're living somewhere around here too okay right here's the game plan if that guy did know about my base or know where i was building it he's instantly gonna come back into that area. It's I would do 
it, that person would do it. So I'm gonna hang around my base. That's risky, but if I can kill him or her, then I can stop them from hopefully taking me out for a little while and try and, you know, it, it's gonna be risky. I don't even have a shield, guys. Like, this is gonna be insanely risky, but I have a god apple. But the person definitely knows because they were walking around my base when I was smelting and stuff. This is what I get for making a risky base. It gets my heart going. I feel like I've been, I, I feel like I'm done. This could be over. Yep, someone's right there. Someone's right there. Someone's right there. Who is that? Has a diamond shovel. I want that diamond shovel. If you're wondering why the person is not taking me out right now, it's because of the fact there's a grace period. You're not allowed to, but in 30 seconds time, that will be a possibility. So we need to get ready for that. Oh God, is are we over before it even started? Possibly, but I'm here to defend my base like a legend I am. <laughs> <laughs> oh, jeez, Louise. Right, armoring up. Here we go. Who's here, huh? Who knows about it? Please don't be inside the base already. Who's here? Who's here? I can hear him. I can hear him. Nope, that's a bunny rabbit. Sword. Krim. Krim. Hello. How's it going? You know about my base? Oh, I don't have a shield, but I have a god apple. Hi, sir. Hi. Do you know? You protecting this area? Okay, we need to acquire ourselves a shield, and let's do it the hardcore way. <laughs> I don't know. This is going to be so risky. I'm oh, no. I've got no shield. Okay, I've got a god apple, though. Let's take, let you take damage. What? I can't hit. Grace period is not off. I repeat, grace period is not off. <laughs> okay, this is awkward. Is grace off now? Oh, it is, it is. Oh, go on, spiders. Help me out, help me out. Go on, that's it. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, give me that stuff. Oh my god, you were the guy with the diamond. Hey, guys, 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 guys. Can we talk about this? Can we talk about this, guys? Please, there might be someone over at my base. Guys, come on. Okay, we picked up everything we need. We got the shield. There we go. Lovely stuff. Okay, shield acquired. Also, diamond shovel. Nice. Okay, we managed to fight someone without a shield. That's pretty, that's pretty good. We managed to keep our golden apple within the first fight. Now, if that person knows about my base, we're done for. That's the person I saw with the shovel walking around two seconds ago before the grace period ended. I think I'm done. But hey, gotta be positive. Gotta be positive. Oh, I see someone. I see APLX. I think I found his base. I think I found his base. He just died two seconds ago as well. His <gasps> I found his base. APLX. <laughs> Hello. How are you doing? You're down. I had to eat the gapple. Oh, God. This is going to get awkward quick. Uh... <laughs> oh, Jesus. <gasps> Okay, I died, I died, I died, but I took him out, I took him out. Oh god. Okay, we gotta craft quick. Oh no, okay, we're after dying with a golden apple. So silly. We just have to take him out. Is that his laugh lies? Let's just get the jump on him. Oh my god, he died, but I did too. Okay, okay, we just need to get out of here. Oh, he's dead, he's dead, he's eliminated, he's eliminated, he's eliminated. I know where the stuff is. I just gotta go get it. Oh my god, this is so messy. <laughs> to fall damage. Oh god. Okay, I'm going back for it. Go back for it. He better have not eaten that golden apple. That's my golden apple to nom nom. Oh my god, this is insane. I don't know what's going on right now. There it is. There it is. Thank you, Creeper, for exposing the base. Oh, go, 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 go. He ate the golden apple, or did I eat the wrong golden apple? No, I can't have. He must have ate it. The cheeky bugger. Okay, I grabbed the stuff. I grabbed the stuff. <laughs> I can't believe what just happened there. What a trade. This is the messiest hider hunt we have ever played and we're living in a desert temple like such a bad idea. Okay, let's try to get out of here. <laughs> this is so messy. All right, we're out, we're out, we're out, we're out. We haven't been taken out yet. There is still a strong possibility. APLX died from fall damage and it looks like he got lucky and the game glitched and since he died to fall damage and not a player, it seems like it didn't knock him out. That's very fascinating. He ate my golden apple though, the cheeky little bugger. All right, guys, let's keep fighting on. I thought someone found my base, but if someone did, surely I would have been knocked out so far. Krim kind of scared me because he kind of said like, hey, are you protecting this area? And that's kind of made me a bit like wary of him. But we're going to go off and explore and look, if our beacon gets destroyed, our beacon gets destroyed. We've just knocked someone out and I'm happy for that. I wish it was a bit cleaner, but it went down as it did. <laughs> and I haven't died in Hyder Hunt in ages, so I feel like, you know, I have to die a few times to make it right. Right, where is everyone else? It's so quiet. <laughs> Hello. Who are you, Mr. Mystery Man? <laughs> Oh, it's Herp. It's Herp again. Hello, buddy. You're back. I've got a golden apple, but I need to make sure I eat it at the right time because I don't do that much. He's mu he must be low. He must be low. Oh, no. There's Krim. I think I'm done for, guys. I think this is over. Stay crouched. Stay crouched. Nezha's here, too. They're fighting. They're fighting. I might be able to grab that gear. Oh, my God. Someone's here. Invisible. I'm definitely being found. Someone's digging the desert temple. It's over for me. These are my last words. Making risky bases is fun.
but it's not fun when you die a lot. And now this episode, like, I've, I've died. I suppose it's just pot luck. It's just luck of the game. So many people here. Barry's also here. There's a guy invisible digging around the place. I can't leave. Barry is right there. I can't leave. I can't go anywhere. <gasps> oh my God. Ned's just right underneath me. Nah, 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 nah. No, no. How is this? Nah, like, come on. There's no way. This is over. Oh, they're fighting. They're fighting. I could just hear someone digging. If they keep digging, they'll never find me. But if they mine, they will find me. But it's not Nezha's that digging. There's someone here that is also digging. But they must be like teaming, like helping together. I don't know. Oh, I can hear mining. I can hear mining. I can hear mining. No, don't mine. If you mine, you're going to find me. No, Nez is right underneath me. No, please, no. I want to live. They're mining blocks. No, stop taking apart the desert temple. Leave me alone. Approximately 10 hours later. My pinky is really hurting. Like, I think my pinky's going numb from pressing shift this whole time. Oh my God. What are Kiki and Nez are doing? They're just fighting in the sky. <laughs> Ninja just MLG water bucket. Oh, oh, Techers is going. Don't worry, guys. I'm just literally sitting here. Just chilling, guys. You just do your thing. Oh, two people just got eliminated. Someone is drinking an invisibility pot behind me. Kiki's there. Someone's chasing Kiki, but it seems a bit. I can't leave still because there's still someone digging about very close to me. Oh, my God. Why is there so much digging here? Why is there so much digging? Can you guys leave me alone? Right, guys. We're just going to wait it out and um, hopefully survive. That's it. That's all we can do. Okay, it's very quiet. I don't hear anyone. I need to not get spotted coming out of here, so I need to be really smart, which I don't know how to do that. So I'm going to like pretend to swim out of the water. Like, I'm so done for. I'm so done for. Like, this is the most random hydro hunt I've ever done. I've survived so far, and I don't know how, to be perfectly honest. I, I, I don't know how. I have no gear. I can't craft. I can only craft and smelt and all that at my beacon. So, and I don't want to do that right now because... So, I need to find some armor. <laughs> Just some armor sitting on the floor would be nice. Just looking for... Oh, yes, yes, yes. That's what I'm looking for, armor. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, oh, no. Come on, dude. Who is that? No, toxic. Oh God, we're back in our base. <sighs> okay, we made it out of the base. We actually managed to craft up a full set of stuff. That's pretty nice. Don't have a shield. Didn't want to craft it. Was too scared. Let's just keep on going. <laughs> I don't know, guys. Right, if you're still watching this, thank you for tuning in. This is the Hydro Hunter experience. We've had some really, really good seasons. I'm not gonna lie. Some really, really good ones. And this one's a good one, but a good one in its own way. Like, I feel like, you know, we've been getting absolutely destroyed. I made some silly mistakes, but like our base, the main thing at the moment, it doesn't matter how many kills you get. It just matters that you're the last base standing. That's it. And so far, we're still standing when we shouldn't be. We've defied all odds. Oh, Techers was slain by Krim. Okay, I need to find a shield somewhere so I can collect it. There's a shield. There's a shield. Found one. I knew there'd be one here. Okay, shield on. Okay, there's Herp. Let's get some revenge, shall we? Come on. Let's get some revenge on Herp. Also, I think he might know where my rough base is because he was searching around that area and he was really invested. Come on. Let's do this. Let's do this. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm gonna eat so I can regen a bit. He's also eating too. Oh, he didn't get, he didn't get that eat off. He, yes, he messed up. There we go. Right, he's down. Where does Herb live? That's what he might... I think, feel like he must live close. Because, like, we've been in constant contact with each other all the time. There we go. I got revenge. He didn't give me back my golden apple. He must have consumed it. But, hey, would, who wouldn't? They're deliciously tasty. Ooh, supply drop. Yes, please. Is that a supply drop? I think it is. I kind of need a supply drop. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Don't come for me. Don't come for me. Don't come for me. Okay, good, good. You're not coming for me. Ah! Okay, never mind. That's not gonna work. Oh, Barry's gonna come jumping for me. That is Fatal over there. Hello, Fatal. How are you doing? Do I have a bow? Please say I have a bow. No, I don't. Okay, motivational speech. Right, it's been a rocky start, right? It's been a rocky game, but we're gonna start knocking people out. We're gonna try and win this thing. We can't just sit around and just be like, come on, let's protect our base. Our base has defied all odds so far. We need to start playing the game and knock out the other opponents as quick as we possibly can. So let's begin the search and let's begin by potentially killing people, sending them back to their base, triangulating their rough locations, and then taking them out from there on. Let's do this. Like always, let's always check a good corner. Oh my god. Like SSR, you've been playing this for so long. Don't build a base in the corner. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, blast furnace. Oh, sick. Where's his beacon? Oh, it's there. What a cheeky guy. SSR, you are out of the game. That's one less person to hopefully worry about once you get knocked out. Did you have anything in the chest? Any good uh, books, armor? I do need that, but I'm not going to store it in the base. Obviously, I'm not going back to my base for a second. What I really want is golden apples. Like, I need some more survivability or a diamond axe. I have realized now that a diamond axe does a lot more damage. I'm actually 
shocked by that. I was literally like, I was like, I'm gonna search the corners. And like, I've already went to like, obviously that corner because I live there. I've already went to that corner. And this was the second corner. I suppose maybe I should go and search this corner over here. You never know. There could be a base. <laughs> but I would like to take SSR out. I do like knocking people out because that's technically one less person to technically have to find you. Oh, Kiki. Don't know if he sees me or not. I want to get that first hit off. I think he does. Or I think he's just clueless. He must know. He must know. He must know. Oh, cheeky. Cheeky, cheeky. Okay, he's got a lava bucket. I need to be careful. He's going to try and heal up. Talk has been eliminated. Nice. Come here, Kiki. Come here. Oh, that's a mess up. Oh, you bugger. He's low. He has to be low. Eaten. Come here, buddy. Should have saw that one coming. I've regen, so I feel happy, but we're talking about trading hits here. I have a bow, don't I? No, I don't. <laughs> Kiki got slain by Jamie Raven. Who's that? Herp. Hello, Herp. Right, Herp, we fight again. That's it, that's it. Come on, this is a kill. This is a kill. Done deal. Okay, Herp is down. Where'd you come from, though? Where did you come from, Herpy? Oh, no. No! Okay, that didn't go as planned. I knew it. Thank God I didn't craft. Karim, I think, is back over here. If you remember at the start of the game, um, Karim was like, am I protecting somewhere? So Karim has now killed me, and now has came over here to try and triangulate me. So I'm going to make sure that doesn't happen. Is that him there, or is that someone else? I don't know. There's a name right there. Oh, it's Herp. It's Herp. Yeah, he's looking for me. He's out to get me. Oh, yellow wool and barrier here. Uh-oh. Don't set TNT off. Uh-oh. How has my base not been found? Like, it's been the most searched area. I, I think I spoke too soon. I was... Yep. I don't chat with no one. I don't chat with no one. I don't chat with no one, okay? Come here. You're down. Come here. I don't chat with no one. <laughs> <laughs> this is my base, my territory. I don't chat with no one. You hear that? No one. You guys don't know where my base is. If I can kill Yellow Wool, I can kill the information with him, and then I can also kill the information if I can find Barry's base. But that's another one. That's another story. Okay, Yellow Wool needs to go. Remember Yellow Wool that time when you knocked me out? Herpy derpy, herpy derp 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 Hey, do you not have no shield? If so, I'll use my sword on you. That'd be a lot better. Oh my god, swords are so quick. There we go. Herb's down. That's honestly such a nice feeling to know that he's gone. Herp was the most annoying person for me. He was always on my case. I don't know who knocked him out, but whoever did, did me a favor. Thank you very much. Sword is so quick to hit. It's unreal. How am I still in the game? I do not understand. I should be found by now, but I, I, I have been found. But like, as in like, I should be knocked out. You know what I mean? If I can stop them getting to me, like I need to take out Yellow Wool. I've got two people that know about it. So if I can take out Yellow Wool, he's in his last life. Then I have to worry about, I don't have to worry about two people. I can just keep an eye on one person and wherever he goes, he goes. But like, surely Barry's gonna come back here. Like he's going to. Kiki? I don't want to fight with you right now. I'm on a mission to find Yellow and Barry. There's Yellow. There's Yellow. I'm going to try to come up behind him as quick as I can. He's beelining for the base as well. Oh, and so is... Oh, Kiki. Yeah, go on, Kiki. Do the job for me. Go on. That'd be great. Go on. Yeah. Take him out. Take him out. Take him out. Come on. Let me just take out Yellow. Kiki. 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 No. Kiki, stop. Kiki. Be a good boy. Kiki. No. My beacon. No. <laughs> <laughs>